hi guys welcome back to my channel my name is sister abayisi and if you're new here welcome and if you're old here thanks very much for staying please don't forget to subscribe comment like and share to all your friends all your families to subscribe to my youtube channel so if you're new here this channel is about travel food lifestyle just name it in today's video i went to the central region over the weekend with a couple of friends and i did a vlog yay like you should see we went to a place called gomwa wonderland it's a resort and it wasn't bad we had had a couple of activities like bonfire we did karaoke we did kings you know it was very interesting let me tell you one interesting thing i did that i never thought i would do i actually slept in a tent so there are tents and there are cabins so it's either you book the tent or you book the cabin but uh, my friend and i decided that we wanted to have that tent experience so we'll do a night for the tent and nights for the cabin so in all we had two we stayed two nights in gomba wonderland but i think there will be a part two of this video where i show um, in detail how the tent looks like and how the cabin looks like personally when i saw the tent i really didn't want to, i really didn't want to sleep inside because i wasn't too sure about it but my friend she convinced me that oh at least we should have a feel of that so we did one night and then it wasn't that bad it was okay and then the next morning we just had to transfer to the cabin i hope you enjoyed this vlog i took time to make this vlog and i hope you like it please don't forget to leave a comment and tell your friends to also do so let me know what you'd want me to talk about or shoot in my next video and i'll do just that all right guys come to gomba wonderland with me this is me when i got to abekan la paz there was quite traffic because it was a friday and i didn't set off early i was going to meet my friend at her place and then we can set off to gomba fast forward we go to gomba and this is the entrance to the resort so you can see the billboard you have to drive about two minutes from the billboard to the main place so when you get to the entrance you see entry fee and then um, the prices there yeah so you bypass that and you go straight downwards you go straight and then here we are and then we get to the main place so this is gomba wonderland and this is like the the bar or restaurant you can actually sit and eat or buy some drinks or buy snacks anything you want to do you can just have your seat you can play ludo you can play uno everything right um, in this space so you could see a couple of them on the table you can see the ludo and if you go to the other table to you see um, the uno this is actually like um, a playground for children so i had to just take a shot of that too and it's really nice i think it's colorful looking at um what they have there so yeah take a look isn't it beautiful yes you have some bicycle to bicycles that you can ride around and all of that and oh i love these very ones because i get to see the monkeys play and it was very nice to see you know two of them were just caged and playing around yeah the place is so big i won't lie it's very big and then i moved all the way to the pitch where you can see a couple of things and people around it's a very big pitch and you can actually have fun there because there are a lot of activities that you can actually do on this field unfortunately i didn't go for the boat riding because i didn't wake up early and when i woke up they had left me <laughs> my fault yeah so you will go for the boats riding here and then they went for hiking as well i didn't go honestly please forgive me because i don't know i was just tired so i had to sleep and i slept a lot so i just wanted to give you a view of it 
this is me when i was taking some pictures and oh girl i had to pose yeah i had to pose and then get some content for my ig so this is when the guys decided to play uno me i didn't play the uno because i do not know how to play instead i decided to video them and then yeah to show you guys isn't it beautiful and then the night came by and we had our karaoke this is someone performing and dancing it was fun it was really fun so i wanted to show you some of the people around yeah these are some of the people i went with and this is when we had to go and do the bonfire in the night we actually did it um behind should i say behind the lake so there is um this that leads to behind the lake so you have to walk on it and then voila here are we victor did the bonfire i really liked this part because it was beautiful to watch and it's been long i actually did watch something like this so it was really nice for me it was calming sitting around the fire and then we played a couple of games which i was new to <laughs> yes so he kept on putting the kerosene in the fire he kept on doing that for like 10 minutes yeah for like 10 minutes it took it took a lot of time so he went around the fire he went around he went around kept on putting the kerosene no they actually said it wasn't kerosene it was petrol if i'm right yes i'm not sure it's kerosene when i asked they said it wasn't kerosene yep so everyone was trying to settle in so you can see people with their chairs trying to find a place to sit and then we kept on on and on and on we kept on on and on and it really took time honestly it really took time it's not easy to get bonfire i mean i didn't know that it i didn't know it takes a lot of work and effort well regardless we did it and then guys I had to sign out here. This is really leaving Gumba Wandala. I know I didn't give you the full, the full, full, full gist in this video, but like I said, there will be a part two where I show you um, the tents we slept in, the cabin room, and how it looks like. So yeah, I hope you watch out for part two, and I hope you enjoy it, guys. I'm so glad you watched it. Please leave a comment. Thank you so much. Mwah.